Hello boys and girls. Today I want to show you the Branton Hydrolyzer, personal hydrogen refill station that you can use to refill your hydrocore cells to use with the Branton reactor to generate electricity on the backpack and outdoors. I'm proud that I can show you this refill station. I've got this cheap from a store and uh, I use the Branton reactor to charge my electronics when I'm out and I did refill the hydrocore cells uh, in a shop but now I can refill it with my at home um, yeah so let's have a look that's a little unpacking we have nothing stand in the way of adventure the Branton H2O hydrolyzer personal refill station. This is the package it comes in. Clean, safe hydrogen power made from water. Here you have uh, the specs uh, and it generates the hydrogen from water. Uh, you only need distillated water and energy electricity and then the unit will produce the hydrogen and put it in the reactor cells in the hydrocore they call it hydrocore so you can see the schema here and uh, Branton claims that it could be absolute clean power and this is possible if you use some clean method of energy uh, like uh, solar or wind generated power with a buffer battery and then you can use the Branton refill station you only need water but distillated water and the energy and you refill your hydrocore cells to use with the Branton reactor. So let's have a look inside. If you open up the box, power forward, strong words. Here we have the AC adapter. Some cables, power cable for the AC adapter, the AC adapter itself, and nicely it comes with different plug in options depending in which country you live. You can use these adapters. Okay, give this by side. We have the user manual. The hydrolyzer user manual. We see the unit and the AC adapter. On the top you have a water tank for the distillated water and a wastewater tank a little instructions operation instructions the late signals they can light green or red or blink green or red Shimata with the solar power, a buffer bank to power up the hydrolyzer or if you're at home or you have normal power, the AC adapter. And on the back side, frequently asked questions and uh, troubleshooting. 
manual, very short, small manual, and here is the unit. It's only you, so I'm really excited to put it out. looks like a little wash machine but it's an hydrogen generator so I already plugged in the right AC adapter and now have a look at the unit and then try to, to charge the hydrocore cells And the hydrogen reactor where we use the hydrocore cells to generate the electricity to charge up your phone or GPS or lamp or laptop tablet when you're outdoor and if you like to know a little bit more about it go to my old video and my update video very important you have to use distillated water for the charging process. So that's the Branton hydrolyzer unit. I said it looks a little like a washer for your clothes. That's funny. Here is the opening where the hydrocores put in to charge them. The lead indicator the sides nothing and on the back you have specifications and the port to power it up and here on the top there is a lid and I think this is the water tank yes here you fill in the distillated water and this is the wastewater tank and if this is full there are contacts if the wastewater tank is full or the main water source tank is empty then you have to refill or replace it the lead here will indicate this okay so let's fill up sucker and try it out so carefully pour in the water and fill it all up to the upper mark here <coughs> fill it all up to this upper mark adapter and plug it in the AC adapter is plugged in the water is filled and yes and it blinks green to indicate it's ready for the charging now you only have to plug in the hydrocore cell, stick it in and screw it in with two fingers, not too loose and not too hard, just with two fingers tight and the light, the light is shown red, that means the process of recharging the hydrocore cells has started. In the manual they say it took about five hours to recharge, to fully recharge one cartridge. If you do this process for the first time it may need a little longer. <coughs> Some friend who already 
got this problem, told me um, he needs up to eight hours for fully recharging the hydrocore cell. But keep in mind that the hydrocore cell generates electricity with the Bronton reactor for six to seven hours in the field when you use it. Okay, that's the Brandon hydrolyzer, personal hydrogen refill station, and and I will wait and look if it's recharging the hydrocore cell. There could be some noises while the process is running, but that's normal, and you should place it on a ventilated area ah, so you can hear the noise a little tickering the manual says that's normal ah, so let's look what it does you can see while it's generating and running there is a little gurgling here It's a tank for the wastewater, and if this little tank is full, it goes in this wastewater tank here. But uh, just I don't know if you see, it's just a little water here inside. It's a little gurgling. There also may occur some venting and the tickering. But now we have to wait and see how long it takes to charge the cell. Okay, see you soon.